I'm back, I'm back, I'm back in Gilby. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back in the Disneyland of geocaching. You know, when you visit an amazing place and you have a great experience, the whole time you're away from that place, you're dreaming, you're dreaming of the next time that you can go back to that place. So I'm back, I'm back guys, at the Disneyland of geocaching, and that is Gilby, North Dakota. This is the home of Tricasius, an incredible gadget cache builder. And I can't wait, I can't wait to see all that is in store for this visit. Most of these caches are on the side of a country road. Country road, take me home. And along these country roads are some awesome geocaches. All right, look, it's ground zero. Look at all those beacons. Look at all those places to hide things. <laughs> Actually, look at that, there's not much here. We got one beacon. It is a minimum maintenance road sign. Investigating the sign, we've got, we got a few bullet holes. We got a full few bullet holes. Oh, whoa, what is this? This Is this the geocache? Geocache, that is like a part of somebody's car right there. But look it, we have something out of the ordinary. It is uh, a pipe. It is some sort of pipe with a little hat. Let's take its hat off. Interesting, what, what is that? Here's a pro tip. If you look at the geocache and you're like, what in the heck? What in the heck am I supposed to do with that? It's always wise. It's always smart to look at the cache page. This geocache is called A Penny for Your Thoughts and it requires a tool of the trade. So I, I'm guessing the tool to reveal the geocache might be, it's probably a dollar. No, it's, it's probably a penny. Do I have any pennies? Do I have any pennies? Am I a prepared geocacher? Let's, let's go back to the van. Let's see if we can find some pennies. All right, here we go. Oh boy, now this, this is just, this is just embarrassing. What do we got here? We got some Reese's, we got some caffeine, Subway, envelopes. You guys, the inside of my car is just, Embarrassing. You guys have that junk drawer, that junk drawer in your house where all the random stuff is? Well, well, this van has a junk drawer as well. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm rich. So the question is how many, how many pennies, how many pennies am I going to need is the question. Let's bring a few. Let's bring some nickels, dimes, Alright, back at the sign. Truck. Truck. Alright, I'm back at the sign. Let's see. Let's see if this cache is coin operated. Take your hat off again. Push it down. Pushed it. Nothing. Oh no, I'm I <laughs> you guys I might need more. I might need more. Here's another penny. All right, I'm, <laughs> you guys, I might need a free hand for this. All right, I might need more pennies than I thought. I got three pennies in, and I, I feel something down there. How many is it gonna take? I got three in. Here's number four. It's actually, I feel it pushing a bison tube down. I feel it, I feel it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes, it took four pennies and I was able to pull the bison tube down. It looks like it's on a spring. So I gotta sign this, put it back, and then it'll spring back up and hopefully get my money back. Open up, you little rascal. I need another hand. I don't want it to shoot back up. This is very tricky to do with one hand. I don't think my hands have ever been so full when trying to sign a logbook. <laughs> Found it, that's a find, people. All right, now to successfully return the logbook. <laughs> oh, try Cassius, rolling it up, put it in the lid, 
twisting it. All right, you geocache, I want my money back. I want my money back. You ever played coin-operated games and you got your money back? Well, watch this. <laughs> All the money came back. I bet you if you really look for a while, you're able to find lots of uh, lots of pennies here on the ground. Because I lost oh, one, two, three. I got my money back. Yes! That was a successful find. I'm in the middle of the country road. It makes me happy. It makes me want to do a cash pants dance because those cash pants are on. That was awesome. I've never got a Bison tube geocache quite like that with some pennies. All right, thanks so much for watching. Now go over here. You want to watch more adventures and I'll meet you over there at the next video. Woo!